Balloon arches and balloon garland are such a fun way to decorate. Hello everyone and happy football season. My name is Callie Bransford from But First Coffee. Today I'm pretty excited to share with you some of my favorite DIY crafts that you can do to get your house ready for the big game. Balloon arches and balloon garland are all the rage right now and they're such a fun way to decorate because you can literally put them anywhere. I personally have chosen to do mine around the TV because for game day this is the main event. They're so impressive looking but I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. They are so easy to make. Come on, I'm gonna show you how. Okay, so the first thing you're going to need to do is obviously blow up a lot of balloons and I highly suggest you get yourself a little hand pump like this. They're only a couple of dollars. It's gonna save you a ton of time. Now you need a variety of colors and sizes. You can buy them on your own, but you can also buy kits online that's gonna save you a lot of time. My kit had a variety, so I have 10 inch balloons, five inch balloons, and then I have 12 inch balloons. All right, once all of your balloons are blown up, we are going to make our garland using this balloon garland strip. It's going to make making the balloon garland so easy. All you do is you string your balloon through the large hole and then you slide it through to the little hole that sort of secures it into place. And you're just going to alternate putting a balloon on the front of the tape and then the back of the tape. And there's no rhyme or reason here. You want to do a variety of colors and then you just want to keep stringing until you've created the length you want. Now it is time to string up the garland. You're just going to use a couple of command hooks, a little bit of fishing wire. I'm just looking for any places that look a little bit too open, taking a glue dot and sticking the balloon into that spot. Okay, this last step is totally optional, but I also got these football shaped mylar balloons and I'm going to add these into my garland to really amp up my football game day balloon arch. One thing I love to decorate for parties is the front door, because when your guests arrive, it's the first thing they see, it really sets the tone. And even if you're just staying home, celebrating with the family, let the whole neighborhood know today's game day. Let me show you. This DIY is super simple. All you are going to need is some brown craft paper. You can get this right at the dollar store, and you're going to cover your entire front door in the brown craft paper. Fold the paper over the top and the bottom, and just tape it into place on the back of the door. You're going to use some white tape. You could either use white duct tape. I had white electrical tape in my house. Either of these work fine. And you're going to create the laces of your football. And that is it. Your front door is game day ready. There's just something about an ice cold beverage and game day that go hand in hand. And what's better than pouring your favorite beverage into a pint glass with your team's colors? I'm going to teach you how to marble dip dye your own pint glasses. And the other thing that's super fun about these glasses is because they don't necessarily scream football, you can use them year round. You're going to need some plain pint glasses to start, as well as spray paint in the colors for your team. Then you are just going to need a large bucket of room temperature water deep enough that you can dip your entire glass inside. You're going to take your spray paint and spray it on top of the water in alternating colors. So you're sort of creating a repeating pattern. Now you don't have to go super fast, but you do want to move pretty quickly through this so that the paint doesn't dry on top of the water. Take some type of stick and gently swirl the water to create the marble effect. Then take your pint glass and dip it. We're not looking to cover the entire glass. We also want to leave the top of the glass free of paint so that when you're drinking it, your lips aren't touching any paint. You're going to want to leave these outside for about an hour to dry and then they are good to go. You have glasses that are game day ready in your team's favorite colors.